hey guys welcome back to part 3 of microsoft excel shortcut keys so in this video I'll, i will show you some important shortcut key of microsoft excel so watch this video till the end and if you didn't watch the part 2 or part 1 then i have given the link on my video description as well as the end screen of this video okay so you can watch part 1 and part 2 so let's start the part 3 so first shortcut key is how to uh, insert the formulas so just type the is equal to button and now select your cell and then select your formula like this and hit enter so is equal to to start the formula and the second shortcut key is how to insert the function press shift f3 and here from you can easily select your formula or function yeah good and how to open the micro alt f8 press the alt f8 the micro will be open okay and to open the uh, visual basic press alt f1 your visual basic will be open and how to add or unhead ribbon very simple just press ctrl f1 your ribbon will be had and to get back it again just press ctrl f1 again your ribbon will be back it's very easy and the next shortcut key is how to insert the new sheet so if you want to insert the new sheet just press shift f11 and that's it as you can see the sheet has been inserted and to link the formula okay so if you want to link the formula in from the different sheet for example i want to link the formula from the uh, previous sheet just type is equal to and then hold the control and press page up or down to move between sheet okay so now i will take this one just select the cell which you want to get on your last cell and that's it as you can see the formula has been linked to the previous sheet so this is how you can link the formula formulas in between your sheet and how to open the style dialog box just press alt single quote and you will get the all detail about your sheet like uh, its number alignment font border fill production all this thing you will get okay and to delete the cell just hold the control and press minus and now you can select entire column or entire row just hit enter and that's it yeah it's very simple and to insert the cell just hold control shift and press plus now select what you want row or column select it and hit enter your column will be or row will be inserted okay good and now let's see how to open the paste special if you copy something from internet or any other thing sometimes we need to open the paste special so i have copied here text and to open the paste special just press ctrl alt v and here you will get paste special now you can select uh, what type paste you want like formula values and okay that's it and now let's see how to delete the uh, worksheet hold the alt and press e l and hit it up your sheet will be deleted okay and how to insert the symbol hold the alt key and press i s the symbol box will open and you can select your favorite symbol here and hit enter that's it yeah okay and to search or go to a specific uh, cell just press f5 and here type the reference for example uh, a20 or like this and hit enter so it will be on the a20 cell as you can see here and now some uh, common shortcut keys like ctrl s to save yeah everyone know this ctrl c to copy and ctrl v to paste ctrl z to undo ctrl x to cut and ctrl y to redo and to make a bold just press ctrl b and for page layout or print layout just press ctrl p yeah this is a very easy shortcut now let's come to the important shortcut keys okay so sometimes we copy the text from internet and the text will come with a lot of formatting like color change or background or underline or italic so how to clear the format of text so here as you can see 
I have some tags and on that there is a format underline and italic so I want to clear all these things so for this first select the text and then press alt h e f and boom look at that so all formatting has been deleted but you need to uh, give the your border that's it look at that yeah simple and next is how to sort like alphabetically or numerically so just select your text which you want to sort and then press alt h s and here select how you want to sort like a to z or z to a or custom sort and then hit enter that's it and let's see how to open the data analyze for this just hold alt and press f e your data analyze will open here okay and to insert the header and footer just hold the alt key and press nh1 now you can insert the your header and footer look at that yeah it's very simple and after this you can go to view and click on normal that's it how to do the landscape or portrait hold the alt key and press p o now select portrait or landscape of your page style okay and now let's see how to insert the page break to insert the page break just press alt p and b and now just hit enter to insert the page break look at that the page break has been inserted okay and and to remove the page break do the same like alt p b your page break will be removed just select the remove square break and hit enter that's it and next is how to insert the background image to insert the image just press alt p g and select your image from internet or from your computer select image and insert it and that's it now your image has been inserted to excel sheet yeah good and now let's see how to see the formula sometimes we got the confused about exactly uh, which type and where the formula is applied so to view the all formulas from your excel sheet just press alt m h look at that it will show the your formulas and applies formulas okay yeah and to get back in normal board press the same thing like alt m h and that's it okay and next is how to view the page break press alt w i your page break will be applied and to view the normal just press alt w l yeah and to view as a page layout just press alt w p you can see your data will be shown in the page layout and if you want it normal just click on normal and next is how to freeze the row just keep the cursor end of the row where you, where you from we want to start the freeze for example i want to freeze this row so i have kept the cursor here and now press alt w f r so your row is frozen let's see look at that yeah very nice and to remove this frozen rows just press alt w f and here select unfreeze bands that's it look at that. and next is how to split the window so to split the window keep the cursor from where you want to split and now just press alt w s and your selected window will be split as you can see the window is splitted yeah very good so these are some important shortcut keys which I have tried to show in the part 3 of excel shortcut keys if I have missed any important shortcut key you can let me know in comments definitely I will make a video on that and if you didn't watch the, my previous video of part 1 or part 2 then you can watch it I have given the link in the video description as well as on the end screen of this video and 99% viewer did not subscribe to my channel if you got any help from my video then please subscribe to my channel thank you and bye bye